Kanye West just snubbed Kim's ass once more again because she is out here trying to go on dinner dates with Bianca Sensori and Ye. And this man is basically saying, girl, you is crazy. You were stalking me the other day and now you want to have dinner dates with my wife and myself because you want to control my money, but it ain't going to work. So Kanye West is clapping back at Kim. We all know that Kim was the person who sent paparazzi out in Italy to capture that video with Kanye. Kanye's but exposing because we all know Kanye's ass was out of his pants. Bianca Sensori was in front of Kanye and they all thought, you know, they were doing some dirty, nasty things. But unfortunately, Kanye's team cleared up that rumor to say, you know what? He did not have any idea that his pants was down. Okay, and Bianca Sensori, she was just so afraid of the paparazzi. And they were wondering who sent these paparazzi out in the first place. Because everywhere Kanye goes, there's always paparazzi. We know he hates them. We all know Kanye loves his privacy. So there's no way he is the reason why the paparazzis are there. And they were sent by someone anonymous. And I'm sure y'all know who that is. Kim K, the bitter ex-wife who seems to can't get over the fact that her husband is genuinely happy with someone else. And I know that is some heartbreak for her because this man is also alleged to be moving to Ireland. Like, I don't know why Kanye West is moving to Ireland. I have no idea, but I'm just saying, I think he's traveling the countries, you know, different type of countries because he wants to be inspired. You know, he's coming up with this brand new album. He's gonna release a documentary soon. So he wants to ensure that he experiences full culture, you know, while giving his wife full luxury, you know. Bianca Sensori has her money, don't get me wrong, but she is not used to that Hollywood rich lifestyle, you know. I wouldn't classify Bianca Sensori as rich. I would say Kim is rich, you know, because she has been in Hollywood for years. Bianca is new to all of this, you know, she's new to all publicity, uh, luxury, cars, penthouse. Bianca is new to all of this. So Kanye is trying to allow her to get used to it. And Kim is so salty because Kim thinks Bianca doesn't deserve to be living with Kanye or to experience his money. But she was the type of person who was so quick to help other uh, community to cancel Kanye. Now this man sees someone who he loves and he wants to spend the rest of his life with. He chooses to travel the world and to give this girl name brand clothing, you know, allow her to wear what she wants to wear comfortably without anyone bashing her. But that didn't work out perfectly because Kim bashed Bianca because she was wearing inappropriate clothing around her daughter North. And I was like, WTF, Kim, you of all persons is going to tell Bianca what the hell to wear. Girl, Bianca looked so much better than Kim. I'm not even being biased. I'm just, I'm just stating the truth. I think Bianca looks so authentic, super sexy, beautiful, and she is like more attractive than Kim. And I'm not bashing Kim's age because everyone needs to be old. You know, everyone gets old, but I'm just saying you look at Kim. It's like you're looking at a mannequin. You know, nothing about that girl is real. So I don't know why Kim is coming for Bianca and Bianca is such a badass, sexy Australian chick. Like who tucks their phone in their pants or in their tights? That is some badass bitch uh, PSA going on right there. And let me just say, Bianca Sensori is setting trends because I remember when uh, the head wrap uh, band that she has on, it was a type of trend that was in a couple years ago, you know, in the early 2000s. And this woman is bringing it back. Like, she's not even afraid to set the trends again. Like, she's taking it back. And I love her head wrap. What they call it? A turban, whatever it is. It looks super amazing on her. I think her body is like a billion bucks. 
without being a pucked and tucked with needles and knife. I think she's very rare. Like Kanye West knew exactly what the F he was doing because this woman is like the brand new young generation of what it's like to be married to a billionaire at the age of 28. So I think Bianca's story is way better than Kim. Kim had to sleep with multiple guys back then. Bianca's story only copped one billionaire. So I think Bianca is that girl. And yes, I do believe she's way better than Kim. Okay. But y'all don't come for me. Y'all just let me know what y'all think down below in that comment section. And follow us on Instagram at Sips Loud. And thank you for sipping with us. Don't forget, we have merches down below. That's right. Check our merches out. Support the channel. And see y'all next time. Bye, guys.